So, what we've got control-wise, which a lot of people have been asking us about, is we've got this line that's only temporary, but that controls the rudder. If I lean right forward, you can see the rudder out to the stern. Obviously, that's going to be fed in, in board so I can steer from inside. What we're also just trying out is to get more onto a beam reach. We're putting the sail, obviously, mainly designed to go downwind, but we're bringing it in this side to the um, starboard side. And um, what we're doing is sheeting it from these aft pulleys, to, um, blocks that we can quickly and easily release out and put back into the normal configuration. Um, and that will allow us to go, obviously, more on a reach. The boat is designed for preliminary downwind, but obviously we're going to need to go on a reach. As well. The sheets are all controllable from inside. So, cheek block onto the uh, onto the sheet, pull it tight, and then we've got. It's not an ideal setup by any stretch of imagination, and obviously the, the mast definitely gets in the way, but it will help us uh, on a bit of a beat, on a bit of a bridge. Um, it might be a bit broad, but um, we're mainly downwind, and that's what we're aiming for. Um, other than that, that is all the controls we've got. Obviously, we can furl the sail. See anyway. We can furl it into most nothing. Just want to say a huge thank you to Robin from start-software.com and all the team that are there. Um, you're all supporting me, it's fantastic. Um, we're out, well I'm out, well I say we, we are, there's Robin in the support boat out there. We're out in the Irish Sea, as you can see it's, um, it's a bit wet out here, it's blowing about 25 knots. I know you can't see how much it's moving around but I can, believe me I can feel it because I'm being thrown all over the place. Um, but um, yeah, brilliant. Thank you very, very much. Really, really appreciate all the support. It's great to be here. Thank you.